The island atolls of the Maldives are known worldwide for their crystal clear waters and coral reefs. They're also home to another incredibly biodiverse and important ecosystem, seagrass meadows. Shahar Hashim is a Maldivian ocean conservationist working to bring this overlooked ecosystem to light. It looks like uh, there's a big, a huge patch of seagrass actually. So I'm going to jump in, have a look first, and then we are going to do a rapid assessment of the meadow. This is to understand what kind of species there are, the species composition, and whether the patch is healthy to do uh, more in-depth surveys. Very little scientific work has been done on the country's seagrass meadows, and new sites are still being explored. Seagrass meadows play an important role for the climate, as carbon reservoirs. There are eight different species of seagrass found throughout the Maldives. The root system of these plants, closely related to orchids and lilies, helps bind the sand together and prevent erosion. A major challenge for an island country like the Maldives. When I was growing up, um, I didn't know much about seagrass. Uh, whenever I saw a seagrass patch on an island, I was warned not to go nearby because there'll be dangerous things uh, living there. <laughs> oh, it's not as beautiful as uh, white sandy beaches. A number of resorts in the Maldives actively remove seagrass meadows. But in Lamu Atoll, Shahar Hashim has helped bring about a change in strategy. The resort has stopped removing seagrass and begun educating its guests through talks and guided snorkeling tours with marine biologists to showcase the environment's natural biodiversity. Six Senses Lamu took a risk protecting their seagrass meadows because we didn't know what the public perception or reaction would be. But we've ended up with this amazing ecological asset that the guests love, but also benefits the wider environment, the corals and also the marine megafauna. Seagrasses are incredibly efficient at storing carbon. Some studies show that they capture carbon 35 times faster than tropical rainforests. The Maldives Underwater yeah. Initiative is currently involved in a global study looking at exactly how much carbon the Maldives meadows could sequester. Once we've split our sediment core into the different depth profiles, uh, we will weigh it, dry it, and then weigh it again. And we will send it off to a lab for analysis. And they will be looking at the organic carbon content inside each of the depth samples. This is really important because it will help us understand how much carbon these marine ecosystems are storing, which would help mitigate against climate change. Seagrass meadows also act as a nursery for small fish including economically targeted species such as snappers and groupers. By educating local communities about seagrasses, Shahar Hashim hopes that both nature and the communities relying on these ecosystems will benefit in the long term. Now we know how important is seagrass because the small fish, uh, they live in the sea, uh, seagrass and they will get some food and we have to keep the fish until they get the big. So then the fishermen can catch the big fish and eat it. And it's very important for the reef fishermen, also the seagrass. So we have to protect the seagrass. The government now plans to put seagrass meadows under protection. And many of the country's resorts have also pledged to protect over 1 million square meters of seagrass across the Maldives. This could mean less drastic interventions in the future. Other countries, um, they've started to actually replant seagrass because their seagrass meadows have disappeared. So we are very lucky because we have so much seagrass and uh, they are increasing, they have increased over the years. It is thought that up to 30% of seagrass habitats have been lost over the last century. But it also seems that these ecosystems are resilient. 
The Maldives Underwater Initiative has tracked the meadows at the resort and identified that they've increased in size by over 20% in the last three years alone. Seagrasses are absolutely essential um, for the future of the Maldivian Islands. Together with coral reefs and mangroves, seagrasses play a really important role in protecting the islands from outside forces, eroding forces. So if we have seagrass, there's a, an extra protection layer for the islands. Thanks to increased awareness of the importance of seagrass for the survival of the Maldives in times of climate change, the researchers hope action will be taken to better protect these beautiful marine meadows.